were amazing today. What happened? I have no idea what you did. I was looking at the prisoner and suddenly, well, that was scarier than me. I mean, I'm pretty scary. How did you do that? You don't have to tell me. In case you have to do it to me, you probably will. I never thought about what it might be like for the prisoners watching me kill other dragons, but I saw that. Now I'm thinking that's going to happen to me, isn't it? So, but still amazing. Stop, Peril. It wasn't me. It's all right. I'd keep it a secret, too. Are you okay? My wing's a little stiff. It can't be that bad. I've been hurt before. <gasps> Not by an ice wing, I bet. It feels better with you near it. Oh, wait, I know what to get. Because I was going for... Stay here. Because I was going where? For a walk? This will heal you. Spread your wings. Is that mud? It heals mud wings. I don't know why. I didn't think of it before. What are you doing? I can't rub it on, on you. You'd burn up. Oh, right. Have you ever thought about leaving? I'm not allowed. I've never been outside the Sky Kingdom. Why not? You must be the most powerful dragon here. I know, but I'd never disobey Her Majesty. Besides, I have to eat the black rocks every day or I'll die. Splat. Black rocks? It's part of the curse of having too much fire. They're really rare. Unlucky Queen Scarlet gets them for me. Have you ever tried not eating them? Once, when I was a lot younger. I got mad at Her Majesty because she wouldn't tell me anything about my mother. So I stopped eating them and then I got sick. Like, dying sick. Queen Scarlet cares enough to keep me alive. My mother didn't. Is that why you don't challenge her for the throne? That's awful. I don't want to be queen. Stop saying treasonous things. Yeah. Feel better? Yeah, sort of. Thanks. Let me out. Please, somebody help me. He can't read in minds at all. A few more herbs. Keep her safe and sleeping. I'll fight as long as I can. Which won't be much longer. I knew these dragons were useless. So much for the great prophecy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Quick, spread your wings. I don't want anyone to see me. Wha 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 why? They're having a trial, and Queen Scarlet says I wasn't allowed to watch. I've never go to trials. They're boring. So why would she tell me I can't go? Something's going on, and I want to see this. Remember, you owe me... I brought you the mud. It's okay, Pearl. I'd help you anyway. Oh, and I found your sand wing. If you hide me, I'll tell you. But if you won't turn me... But if you turn me in, I won't. Sunny, where is she? Pearl, I told you I'd help you whether... Sigh, okay. But won't anybody be looking for you? Not today. I'm supposed to be down in the caves looking for black rocks. Why does Queen Scarlet bother with trials? She likes the drama of them. She thinks it makes her a fair and just ruler. They're starting. Dun, 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 dun. That's Vermilion, Queen Scarlet's oldest son. He always argues for the prosecution. You look particularly deadly today, your majesty. Yes, yes, I know I do. And that old dragon one's osprey he lost his wings in the war but he's my friend he talks like a squirrel so does my friend starflight where's our defendant someone fetch her 
<laughs> Kestrel! You know her? She's one of the guardians that raised us. I didn't like her that much, but they kept us alive. I guess even terrible parents are better than no parents. Loyal subjects. This dragon, Kestrel, stands accused of the highest treason. Disobeying me. Your Majesty, the facts are clear. You gave an order. Kestrel disobeyed you. She deserves a long and painful execution. Very compelling. Well said. Sounds guilty to me. Your Majesty, I do have a few words to say in this prisoner's defense. If you must. You ordered Kestrel to destroy her egg. It was a single egg, but inside there were two dragonettes. One had no fight at all, but the other had too much. <gasps> no other dragonettes like me have hatched in years and years. Too much fire, like you. Is Kestrel your mother? My mother is dead! Queen Scarlet killed her to save me! M -m Maybe that was a lie. We all know this. This Skip to the part where we execute her. You ordered her to destroy the defective egg. However, she fled with it. When you caught her, the dragonettes had hatched. I know, because I was one of the gods that was with you. You told her you'd forgive her and let her live if she killed one of her dragonettes. So she killed the dragonette with too little fire, right there at the river, with her own claws. <gasps> but even though she did what you said, you told us to kill her other dragonette anyway. She grabbed her daughter and tried to fly away. But she was too badly burned and was forced to drop her. She fled, leaving her only dragonette at your mercy. No, my brother died in the egg. I killed him, and my mother tried to kill me. Scarlet is the one who saved me. At least, that's what she told you. You admit Kesserill disobeyed me. Then I think we're done here. But she tried to obey you. You're the one who deserved your order. I changed my mind. I'm the queen. I can do that, you know. Kestrel was always a faithful soldier to you. She followed your orders, and what did you do? You ordered her to kill your own dragonettes. From... It's not true. Tell them. My mother wanted to kill me and Queen Scarlet saved me. Surprise! Your dragonette is still alive and working for me. Peril, you're not supposed to be here. You lied to me. You said she was dead. Would you want have wanted to know your mother was alive? Somewhere wishing she'd killed you? She could have escaped with your brother. She thinks she chose wrong. That's why she never came back for you. <clears throat> Who kept you alive all these years? Finding you black rocks, feeding you, making you my own royal champion. Aren't I a better mother than her anyway? Mm -mm. 
I call upon the tradition of the champion shield. I want to fight for my mother. What? As a queen's champion, I can stand for any co condemned dragon. If I win in my next fight, you have to let her go. Now, where did you hear about that? You. Stop! my friend not anymore the champion is asked to stand with the prisoner sadly i'll choose her opponents and they'll battle at the end of tomorrow's games if peril wins kestrel goes free if not well i suppose i'll have a dead champion but at least we'll get to execute kestrel right away what a wonderfully bloody day for me and Queen Burn. Poor Kestro. Poor Osprey. Poor Peril. Wait, Queen Burn? Oh no, she'll take Sunny. Flap, 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 flap. Peril, you have to t tell me where Sunny is. What are we going to do? Starflight won't survive the arena, arena tomorrow, and Burn is coming to take Sunny. Is that Peril? No. We can save Kestrel. Starflight and Sunny won't make it. Please, Peril, come on. Think about something else. Think about cows. Mm, cows. I wish I could share a cow with my friends right now. I miss them. Peril, finally! Hmm? That's not Peril. That's Burn. Makes a sound. Ding. Ding. Ding 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 they're coming to save the day. They're coming to fight, for they know what's right. The Dragonettes! Hooray! The Dragonettes! Hooray! Stop that noise! Bring the three troublemakers. <gasps> if anyone else sings, burn out their tongue. You... Out! This is my room! Out! You interrupted my feast. You will not do so again. Why don't you just kill them? That wouldn't be fun. I don't care about your fun. We need to stop the prophecy. Let's kill them and get over with it. Well, yes, but think if we kill the dragonettes now, out of sight, it doesn't miss no good. Even if we hang them from the palace walls, no one will believe it's them. But if we put the dragonettes in the arena, everyone can see them die. They'll lose all the faith in the prophecy. That way, with gruesome... ...ness. Don't you agree? What if they win? Trust me, they won't. But killing them ourselves is a solid backup plan. You know we're right here, right? 
Don't you want to hatch your evil plan somewhere more secretive? Who do you think you're till before you die? Yipes! Whoosh! I thought I'd get to play with you longer, but I guess you have to be dead by tomorrow. Nobody lets me have any fun. Sleep well, so you'll be thrilling in my arena tomorrow. I don't like them. Ow! I'm so glad you're alive, you incredibly huge idiot. So am I, but I'm more glad to see you two are alive. Playing that song was pretty smart, Tsunami. Huh? I thought you did that. Okay, guys, this is She Lover signing off on this video on part four.